Hello and welcome to Let's Play Final Fantasy IV. Okay, cool. Eh. I think I almost ruined that intro. But anyway, we're back in the Battle Tower. I'm just going on the floor. Three? Oh, uh, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Is this, like, the right door? Oh. Oh. Recognize this, everyone? Um. You know what? I'm not gonna risk it. But that's the teleporter from the last time we came to the Tower of Babel. Oh, hey. I'm back. Okay, um. Which door do you think? Um. I go with this one. Poor choice. Aha, this is the room I wanted. Now, I'm seriously considering using Hodge right now. But, as I said before, these are cheaper. Even two of these is cheaper than one of these. Which should tell you what I'm about to do. What? You can't do the all set thing as... Who do you think you are, Cecil? You wish you were as much of a man as Cecil. Ha 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 ha! Double tent action! And I should also probably say... That's... Wow, I just still still quite a ways behind the rest of the party. Maybe he wouldn't be such of a pushover if he, you know, had six more levels. But what are you gonna do? Anyway, let's talk about the thing I almost started talking about last time, but then stop! <laughs> um <clears throat> Wait, wait, wait. Am I going up or down? I'm a little confizzled here. It's a basement, so I guess I'm going down? Um... You know, this is a good time to talk about that thing. So, I'm sure that at least some of my people who listen to this, listen to the Nerdy Show, since those are the people I'm constantly spamming to tell them to watch my stream. Not stream, my YouTube channel. But who knows, some of you might be just random YouTube viewers coming along, along and picking up this video. In which case, you should check out the Nerdy Show. So the reason I picked this up is, sorry, bring this up is, I'm running a donation campaign. Or a marathon campaign, really. Anyway, what they do is, they have a donation drive each week. Usually it's for a specialized episode each week. I mean each month. And it's for a specialized episode. But this month, they're doing a movie marathon instead. And I'm campaigning for Gundam. The original Gundam. Or at least the movies. Because the original Gundam is like... I think two hours too long. Maybe three. Uh, oh hey, something's happening. I see dead people. <laughs> Edge. Father! Mother! No, don't do it, Edge! Thank heavens, you're right. You're alive? If you call that living. Come with us, Edge. Yes. Come with us. Where? To hell! So, that kind of sucks. This looks like a time for... This is, would be a good time for learning how to steal, actually. But failing that, let's throw stuff. Also, you gotta cover edge, cause seriously don't need that dude dragging me down. Uh, how much HP do you have? Not enough. 
Titan it is. What's going on? Father! Mother! <laughs> um... Listen, if we're going to eight, that would be awesome. She does... Give... I'm going to go with... Pain. Let's see now. I have no idea what this does. So let's test her on the boss! <laughs> but yes. These... Well, actually, wait. I'm not even going to say that yet, because I think there's a better time to mention it. You know what? Screw that. Just saying it now is more fun. These monsters are... Well, they're monsters. But they actually are the true king and queen of the elves, or ninjas, or whatever the hell Edge's people are. And, in and instantly, that means he's king, not a prince, after we kill them, just like with Edward, but let's not get into that. Um, wait, Kane already has haste! No! Rosa, what are you doing? Oh hey, what did Tin do? I was paying attention. But yeah, they are the real king and queen. They were one human once, but they were turned into hideous monsters. As seen before us. And the king and queen break free. As I was saying. These are the real king and queen. I'm assuming that they're going to elaborate on the whole thing. You know, I actually haven't taken much damage. Like, really, you can hear the sad music and everything. When that comes out, it's when you know shit's going down. Edge. We are no longer human. We no longer belong here. I like how this is supposed to be such a moment, and I'm just spending the whole time wailing on him. But anyway. It is really a sad moment. Once they're human, loving parents, and go good royalty, but they've been reduced to so much less. We must go now. Hideous monsters that, with no purpose other than to destroy, a purpose they themselves have denied. Evelyn lies in good hands. You know, actually, I gotta disagree with you there. Oh. Uh, serve our people well. I don't know. I wanna really disagree with him, but at the same time, it's such a touching moment. You can't just say no to him. Freaky though he is.
You really just gotta trust that he knows what he's talking about. Don't go! Well, that took a long time. Farewell, my son. Mother! Don't go! Yes, they long for death to rid themselves of their monstrous fate. Edge. No. Edge. No, wait, what was... Whatever. The Fiend of Fire! Rubicon! Lugay. How dare he! Rubicon! You sick bastard! It was Luge who turned your parents into monsters. I am sorry for your loss. My only wish is to battle you fairly. Well, Rubicon, I gotta say, I like the cut of your jib. Who hell with your self righteous blabbering? I admire your spirit. I, you know, I like Ruben Kahn. Sure, he's a bad guy, but he's the sort of bad guy you can expect. But, but anger never bears true strength, and it blinds you from what you truly need to see. Shut up! I'll show you the power of rage! He's a villain, but he's not petty. Anger invokes Edge's dormant power. He learns Blood and Blitz? What? Cats and dogs living together? Girls have wings? Well, this is interesting. Still, nothing can penetrate my cloak of flame. Not even ice! So it should be mentioned, I'm officially in territory I have never played before. I do have a pretty good knowledge of a bunch of the later parts of this game, but I've never actually played them, meaning I do not know the specifics of anything, including this fight. So that's going to be kind of harsh. I don't get thrown straight into it. That is so great. Let's see. I might be a little weak on MP for Rydia. I'm good for HP, though. So let's use neither. The first either I've used all game. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do this. I shall restore you to full strength. Do not disappoint. Wait, really? I really like Rubicon. Truly, he's a noble demon. And wow, that's sort of too much peeking. Um, I'm talking about my voice recording, by the way. Although I sort of wish I hadn't w wasted my either now. HP in it. <coughs> An MP restored. Rubicon! Okay. While I certainly respect him, I gotta say, he just looked a little, um, fruity. Oh. I was hoping to get rid of his clothes of flame. He said Blizzard wouldn't work, but I'm gonna try it anyway. It seems like the thing, what? 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 Okay, it's one thing to kill Edge, but that would have killed anyone. Quite easily, in fact. Jump, Kane! Jump! Blood some more. Okay, that just healed him. Um, let's try bio. That was pretty effective. And he's dead again, isn't he? No, Edge is still standing, barely. Ooh. 
Let's see. I sort of want to throw my blood sword at him, actually. But I also sort of don't. Because that's a cool sword. I do have the spare kunai, though. Do it! Oh, I can't throw an ogre axes? That's also good to know. And a little bit lame. Ha ha ha! You know, I'm gonna just stick with bio, actually. A little less effective than last time. Oh, he's about to attack me again. Um, I know. Let's do this. And use blood some more. And then never again. Cause guess what? Edge is out of MP. Damn, that guy sucks. Yeah, that wasn't so bad. Bio! Let's try to steal from him, because that's going to work out so well. I've never been not detected by the enemy while stealing, just to point out. It has never once worked for oh, me. And there goes Rydia. I wonder if there's actually a way to prevent that. Maybe I'm supposed to throw stuff at him? I really don't know. Um. <laughs> Let's see. Need to revive Rydia. Well, it can't hurt to try to throw something else at him. As long as it's not my blood sword. Okay, I don't really have any throwing options on me. That is a little bit lame. Sure, why not? More bio. Okay, Pin totally didn't do anything. You know who really who Rosa that is? Rosa? I meant to say Rosa. Really needs to what's the word? Pace herself. Like seriously. You know, I'm beginning to suspect that Fyra is a counterattack. Just call it a hunt. <laughs> Needs more bio. Ha ha ha! Can't get enough bio. I can probably get enough jump though. Honestly, it's not as effective as I would like. But what are you gonna do? I mean, surely he must be nearly dead by now. Let's try to steal a game. Because again, it seems like the thing to do. Or not. Maybe I should go and punish him. Who knows? Speaking of, let's use Titan. Because it seems as good a time as any. I should probably actually hit him. And it is... Not really a... What? I wonder... I wonder... Well fought, but this is not the end. I shall rise again. Okay, well, I think he's dead now. Yeah, that wasn't so bad except for the glare thing that just kills people outright. Hmm. 7,000 gil. That's a lot. Actually, no, it isn't. And experience! And edge leveled up. 
Even the weak become strong when they gather. I am most impressed until we meet again. There goes the best damn villain in this series we'll see until Gilgamesh in the next game. Father. Mother. You can rest in peace now. Your Highness! What? No, 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 no. Ram! Pray, let us fight with you! Where is that double Rubicon? Also, I totally just desync myself. We got him. It's over. Splendid! They helped at me out. So, who is, is this Golbez? Rube Kent's master. He plans on gathering the crystals to reach the moon. Why the moon? We don't know exactly. He seeks some great power there. We, ha we have to stop him! So he's the mastermind behind all this. I'm going with you. But, Your Highness, Evelyn needs you! That can wait! We've got to stop this guy before it's too late! But... Ah, uh, stop worrying and go home. I'll be fine. Very well, everyone. Please take good care of our prince. Good fortune, Your Highness. Everyone, thank you. And away they go. Okay, let's go get Golbez. We need to get the Christmas first. Right, right, lead the way. And Celsus is in front again. Um. Right. I'm gonna cut off here to go run back and heal and check this floor for items because I don't think that, I think if there is anything on this floor frankly you probably don't need to see me get it I'll make sure I tell you if I do find something though but anyway next time we go into this room which hopefully has the process in it so until then this has been Chaos Blue let's play Final Fantasy 4 see ya